Welcome back to Warbeater Wrestling. Today we're going over the sharpshooter, a move that has been commonly butchered, which is disgraceful considering the history with Bret Hart, Sting, so many more who have used this hold effectively. So we're just going to go over some common mistakes and the most effective way to lock it on. Sharpshooter, obviously we need both legs. So with opponent on their back, maybe using a double, double leg takedown, we're going to stick our foot through to the same side hip. Okay, I see a lot of people go wrong by stepping across the body. We're gonna step same side hip. So if I'm using my left foot, it comes to the same side. Now here's another way that I see it done poorly. We wanna bring that leg over our own leg first. Now, sometimes I've seen people go the other way where they actually bring their opponent's opposite leg over and that's almost like a different type. It, it almost becomes a little bit more like a Texas cloverleaf. It's not a traditional sharpshooter. So we wanna go same side leg over here, and then we can tuck the opposite leg over the top. Everything needs to be tight. The grip is the next point that is commonly done poorly. Essentially with the sharpshooter, it does depend a little bit on your opponent's body and your own. What I like to do is make sure I've got a real deep grip over that straight leg, just like I would for any Texas cloverleaf or half crab. And I like to make sure that my right hand is hooking onto their quad. Now, some people grab the heel. I just feel like the heel has a bit too much room to move. The quad is a more stable joint. Of course, you could get it to the point where maybe you lock your own wrist, like a double wrist lock, that's not gonna to work today. We just don't have the right kind of arm span. So I'm just hooking around, hooking the quad. And my next step is to posture up and bring them to their shoulders. So with a real stable base, we bring them up to their shoulders. We turn, 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 upright posture. And I'm balancing my forearms and my quads for that extra stability. From there, hold the sharpshooter. You could bring them down to the mat and start working other holds. Choice is yours.